I can't help but remember a time when I fell off my horse Magic. This is the first time I've fallen off of him, and he bucked me off while we were riding towards the barn. It was dinner time, so I guess I can't blame him because animals love food, right? I later learned that horses need to put their head down the buck, and my reins are practically in my lap, so I learned to pick my hands out that way he couldn't put his head down that far. I learned from my mistake. Here's the thing. I believe that failure starts and success stops, and failure can also follow success. There's, a, there's an important relationship to consider between failure and success. It's that failure often defines the limits of success or how successful you can be. There's also value in failure. It can teach people that they are just like everyone else. They're unique in their own way, but they're all human and we all make mistakes. Unless you're not human, which is absolutely nothing to worry about, I hope. Anyway, this is why I imagine the brain of a total failure would look like. This is why I imagine the brain of an always successful, perfectly perfect, always person person. They're both non-existent because nobody's a total failure unless they want to be, and you can't succeed without mistakes. That's why I imagine the brain of a person that has made mistakes but has learned from them. Because this is a normal person, they're just like everyone else and they make mistakes. Please don't worry if you make mistakes as long as you know what you did wrong. It's completely normal. Failure should also be a lesson that success is acquired through determination and hard work. It's a simple truth. No success is ever obtained without a failure, or many failures, such as Edison's 1,000 attempts to create the light bulb. Or as he said, it wasn't 1,000 attempts, it was simply an invention of a 1,000 steps. I read a quote once that said, success is not final and failure is not fatal. It is the courage to continue that counts. And what I think this means is that success won't last forever, <clears throat> and failure won't kill you. And but if you keep working at your goal, you'll eventually get it. I entirely agree with this, but it's a pity I don't know who said it. I hope I was able to change your mind on failure and success, or at least make you think about it. Now I have something